Hi, this is Adam Lane with PocketNow.com, and you've probably already seen the, you know, a couple videos of the new Windows Phone 7 emulator that was recently released. Here we have it on a uh, multi-touch tablet, and I'm going to show you a couple things you might not have seen yet. Here I'm holding down the Start menu button for a couple seconds. Open Calendar, and that's the Tell Me app right there. See, powered by Tell Me. Can't access Bing right now. Please try again later. It doesn't always work, but you just heard it reading the message to me over the speakers, so that's got text to speech, which is really great. Let's just try it again. Find pizza. You see this animation up there? Just told me it was searching for pizza. And here comes the list. My location doesn't work. So we only get web results, but that's alright. And if I go back to Bing, let's see if I press that. Oh. I was already in Bing. Okay, here we go. You see the microphone icon there? We've seen this before, but let's try it out. Pocket now. And it searched, and we have Pocket now. There we go. So if I tap that, it's going to open Internet Explorer. And we're going to load the website. Oh, I have three tabs open already. And we can scroll even while it's loading. Still loading. And we can multi-touch. So that's really cool. One more thing that's cool with multi-touch. Uh, the pictures. Oops, I pressed that accidentally. And I can tap and hold here. Just see that menu come up. Change my background. Here's the loading. I can multi touch for enlarging and cropping. So there we go. Let me just show you the settings for the voice. Speech. So we've got play audio confirmations. That's pretty important. Use speech when the phone is locked. That's really good because you can have it in your pocket and maybe use a Bluetooth headset to activate the speech interface and then do some phone calls or opening applications or whatnot. It's not clear entirely how many commands this is going to support right away. And then we have enable speech re recognition over the network. That's so that it can use a server, uh, you know, the Telme servers to recognize and transcribe speech. That's uh, important for the Bing searches. So there you go. Uh, promising not entirely finished, obviously, but looking really good. That's it for now.